Good morning, you guys. Good morning, my beautiful, lovely people. How you guys doing today? I hope you guys are doing well. I really do. Because your girl, she has not been feeling well in the last, like, couple of days. Now, last week, was it a week now? It could have been a week now. I had a really bad like fever blister i had like three fever blisters on my lip and i know that's like so disgusting so nasty because a lot of people you know associate that with herpes which i really didn't know it was associated with herpes until probably like three years ago when i went to the doctor and she was like oh my god you know that that's hep or something one and I'm looking at her like <coughs> lady no one asks you like all you need to do is be a nurse like no one needs you to be judgmental about what my situation is right now you know and I've been getting fever blisses now ever since I was like a kid so I'm thinking to myself like I don't know where somebody went wrong. Like, if it's herpes, then I don't know where somebody went wrong. But let me not put that in the atmosphere. I mean, it's not the herpes that you get on your vagina, obviously, or your penis, or, or your whatever. But obviously, it is, um, you know, it's like, a, like your body, like, forcing out, you know, um... Uh, toxins like boy use and all that stuff like that you know and so i think because i worry a lot you know worry can cause a lot of things to show up on your body and so i don't know how not to worry but anyway so i just had to tell you guys that so i have been trying to like put out a video for over a week now but i've been trying to wait until like you know, I felt better because I had a severe migraine. Like, I... Oh, my God. Like, I had one of the worst migraines ever. Like, I didn't even... I couldn't even think. I couldn't do anything. I just felt like... Oh, I was... I was, like, at such a loss. That's all I can say. It was the worst migraine I have ever had. And I've been having migraines now for the last 20 something years and um that were probably was one of the worst i've ever had like i was <sighs> that's all i can say but anyway you guys i ordered some stuff from mary Kay, and my sister she is a mary Kay lady and she's a professional pretty much at a lot of things and makeup and skincare and all of that stuff is one of the things that she definitely specializes in and you know she looks absolutely spectacular you know her face is just like wonderful and she she's worn makeup like pretty much her whole life and if she wears no makeup she has no blemishes or anything like that because you know a lot of times when you wear makeup for a very long time it really messes up your skin or it can mess up your skin let me just say that i mean maybe not for everyone but she's been waiting for so long you would think that it would have had an effect but she takes such great care of her skin you know and you know genetics probably definitely play a part in it as well um, but yeah, but she, you know, she's a Mary Kay lady <clears throat> and I went ahead and I ordered some things from her. Now, I just want to say this because I think this is so very important and I know probably a lot of you guys, you know, have been hearing this lately, but if you have a friend or a family member and they have a service and that service it's not a non-profit, meaning that they make money off of it. Come on, people. Spend your money with your friends and your family first. Don't look for, you know, discounts and don't look for 
freebies and all that stuff support your family and friends first start there first people jeez uh, all right so anyway um yeah so i ordered some things i paid with my own money and um yeah so i have it i have the stuff and i want to show you guys what i've gotten now I look a lot, I look very rugged and raggedy right now. Now, what I did try to do, I tried to give you guys the messy ponytail, but I don't know what's happening. I don't know what's going on with that. So, anyway, but I've, oh, let me show you guys what I have. I'm not, I'm not really sure exactly all the things that I have um, in this box. This is my box that it came in. But, alright, so the first thing that's in the box that I have pulled out is the Satin Body. And this is a revitalizing shea scrub. So, yeah. So you apply this to wet skin. So I'm gonna, I'm probably gonna use this when I take my shower today. <clears throat> and then I have... Some time wise microderm abrasion refine. And what is this one? This is a pore minimizer. So I think these are just like little treats that she had given me because I don't remember ordering this stuff. I might have, I can't remember. But yeah, so this is how it looks. Yeah, but so when I went to Virginia. When did I go to Virginia? I went to Virginia on August the something. I can't remember. But anyway, so we went to Virginia because, you know, I really don't want to talk too much about what it is that we're doing. But we did go out there for a meeting. And the meeting was, I mean, it was, it was a great meeting. It was, you know, spectacular. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you guys some of our clips or some of my clips from Virginia in some of the meeting, um, that took place. So, cause it was very interesting. We threw a little, little extras in it as well. And so, all right, you guys, so. I want to see what this is. I've been wondering what this is since yesterday. Oh, it's like a, it's a washcloth. That is so cool. It has a little handle where you hang it up on the door. Isn't that adorable, you guys? I think this is absolutely freaking adorable. And it has the little Mary Kay emblem on it with the eyes. This is so freaking adorable. Okay, I'm gonna put this back in the plastic because, you know, sanitary reasons. All right, so what else do we have in this box? Okay, so I have some Time Wise Body Toning Lotion, which I really need, you know, because you wanna keep your you know, your muscles or your body or your skin nice and toned looking. So hopefully this works. And I'm going to go, I'm going to be using this and I'm going to let you guys know how well the this product works. Okay, so yeah. And then I have the deep cleaning charcoal mask. So I want to open this up because I, I am going to use this right now today on camera and i'm gonna let you guys know what my first impressions of it is so this is like i said the deep cleaning charcoal mask clear proof okay so we're gonna use this this one right here is your hydrogen eye eye patches and it's one pair so pretty much i might just go ahead and use this on camera today so 
And then we have the Time Wise Age Minimized 3D Night Cream. And so basically, there's a 4 in 1 cleanser included in this. So it's a whole little packet thing that's going on. And that's it. So that's all I have. Um, she did include like a little gift. So I have some candy. And I have this little candle. So, oh, and it's. It's a scented candle. Oh my goodness. It smells like pine cone. Okay, so that smells really good. All right, so let me go ahead and start um, using this. Now I am going to use this in conjunction with the fat water from Fenty because I want to put some toner on after I use this. So I am going to use the Fenty um toner because i don't see that we are bought anything that um you know like tones or anything i mean like any toner or anything like that i guess i probably could have used one of those packets let me see or what is this i mean i guess i could use the microderm abrasion um refine or the pore minimizer so i probably use that as well so yeah i'm probably using all of this stuff okay so let's do the mask so i have the charcoal mask on and so you're supposed to wait 10 to 20 minutes for this to i guess dry now what i will say with this is that you want to be really careful with putting this on so you may just want to use like one finger one or two fingers to spread it instead of trying to spread it over your whole hand and put it on because it really doesn't make any sense because you just you know so yeah so because it kind of made a little bit of a mess on my hands and it dries and of course you can just wash it off it's okay so we're gonna go ahead and let's let this dry So my face is freshly washed. I have washed off everything, my neck, my face. And let me try to get you guys closer. I like it. I like it. I think it's really, really good. I think it did a really good job of cleaning and I like, like, there seems to be, like, somewhat of a glow to my face now or a brightness to my face after using that. And so I like that. Yeah, I like that a lot. So, again, that, you guys, that is the deep cleansing charcoal mask. I think it did a really good job at at cleansing my face like I really think that it did it did a really good job if you guys can just see you see the water I just what you know wash it off and I like that so that's from Mary Kay chuckle cleansing all right so we're gonna go ahead well I'm gonna go ahead and move on to the next thing so I'm gonna go ahead and put these eye patches on am I gonna twist the eye patches yeah, I'm going to put the eye patches on because I'm going to use this here and then I'm going I'm to use this and this. So, I'm going to go ahead and put these on. We're going to see what these things are all about. Did I have a good country voice? Was that good? You know, I, I was in the South for a while. A good part of my life. So, if you hear some of, what is, what, what's this? All right, so, uh, okay, so this is how this looks. I'm going to straighten it out. Let's straighten it out. And then place it underneath my eye because I really need, I need to like really concentrate on my under eye like a lot, like seriously. 
because I know you guys see the dark circles under my eye. Now, I'm not really sure how far this is supposed to go up under my eye. Um, oh, I got it the wrong way. Yeah, you know, listen. Oh, boy. This is the first time I've ever done this. So, I mean, don't judge me. I know some of you all probably knew that I had it on the wrong way and was laughing at me. You know? I know you were laughing. All right, so I'm going to have that one like that. I think that's good. And let's go ahead and get the other one. And I like the little container that it comes in. It keeps them nice and moisturized, you know. Um, make sure your hands are clean when you handle this because, you know, you don't want... I think I ripped it a little bit. You know, you don't want to have to be putting this on and then your hands are dirty. And, you know, you're putting this close to your eyes where things can get in. Oh, it moves easy, though. That's good. Because I can move it up easily. This is um an interesting feel. Like... Yeah, I can pinch that and it's... I don't know what type of material this is. But it's very interesting feeling. I will say that. Yeah, I will say it's very interesting feeling. So, okay. I can wait these outside. This would be a new fashion statement. Yeah, but um... Okay, so what I want to say. All right, so let me read how long these are supposed to stay on. So 20 minutes, another 20 minutes. All right, so I'm not going to have you guys sitting here waiting with me. So, yeah. Yeah, 20 minutes. I'll be back. In 20 minutes so it's been 20 minutes since I've had the eye patches on and I just wanted to come back on before I take them off and I'm gonna take them off on camera kind of hate to take them off I like this little sensation that is given it's like a little yeah it's a poop poop situation I don't know if it's in my head or if I really feel like something happening. But let's go ahead and take these off. Let's take this one off first because I put this one on first. So, um, it's pretty dry. It's pretty dry. And let's take that one off. And so, yeah. I mean, I don't know if it's just me, but, or if it's what, but I'm, I am kind of seeing like instant results from these eye patches. Like I am seeing like some brightness in this area now. So yeah, but anyway, let's move on. And, oh, did I tell you guys? Okay, so I told you it was 20 minutes. And basically, this is supposed to give your eyes a boost. And I do see somewhat of a boost to my eyes. Now, you're supposed to use this, I want to say, twice a week. Are you supposed to use these twice a week? Yeah, so you're supposed to use these twice per week, but these are the only ones that I have. So, I mean, I like them. I'm I'm going to go back on the Mary Kay site, on my sister's site, and I'm going to most likely order some more of those because I like those. All right, so I like that. And where am I? Where am I? Because I'm looking for the... Um, so I have some Ferment Eye Cream. I am going to put this on as well. And what the hell did I do with the, um, 
and then lost that you guys I lost I hit that all right so I'm gonna go ahead and put this stuff on here so this one is the microdermabrasion refine so the directions are so small you guys at the cleansing apply a small amount of time wise Microdermabrasion refined to wet face with fingertips, rinse thoroughly. So we're not going to use this because I don't feel like, should I use that? Let me see what this one is. This one doesn't really give you directions. So I'm not sure if I have to wash this one off. But I'm going to go ahead and say that because it's a pore minimizer that I can just go ahead and put it on. And I can leave it on so I'm gonna put the eye cream on first and then I'm gonna go ahead and put the pore minimizer cuz you know that way this can go underneath and so yeah all right so I work that into my eyes uh, it's a nice consistency a nice thick sort of thick consistency okay so I'm gonna go ahead and take the pore minimizer and I had to do a few little pumps before it came up so this is about how much I'm going to put on my face okay so that is it and it does it gives your face a nice glow I'm all about the glow I'm all about the brightness I'm all about the glow I'm all about making the face look nice and smooth and I think that these products they all pretty much you know accomplish that so again this is the pore minimizer it doesn't say whether it needs to be washed off, but I'm going to hope that it doesn't need to be washed off. And so, yeah, and, you know, it's not an abrasive smell. You know, it doesn't, you know, feel overly tacky. I mean, it feels a little tacky, but it doesn't feel overly tacky, um, which is, you know, always a good thing. And it feels, you know, nice and light. So, I really like this Mary Kay. What you guys think? I like this Mary Kay. Okay, so like I said, I am going to put some of the fat water toner on. And this is only just because I just want to, you know, put some of this on. I haven't used it since I did my video. Uh, so, I do want to go ahead and, you know, use a little bit of this. Just to give it something a little extra, right? A little extra. I'm going to give it a little bit extra. So, that just gave it a little extra glow. You know, nothing too much more. But a little extra glow. You know? Just smooth that in and that's it so all I need now is something for the lips and that's I am gonna go on the Mary Kay site on my sister's um, site and I'm gonna look and see if they have like a lip scrub for the lips if they don't have any then I will go ahead and order some from the Fenty line, as I have said before. But anyway, so I'm finished with my little face glow up. All right, so you guys, I'm going to complete this video for today. As always, I love you guys. Thank you guys for watching. Continue to watch. And um, I will... Be back on soon. Mwah. I love you guys.